Hey, what's up everyone? It's Leo here again, and as you guys might have noticed, I'm not an English speaker. I'm from Brazil, but I'll try my best though to make another video on Rainbow Six Siege. Today's video is a request of my subscriber, Alex. He asked my help to improve his aim skills, so let's try them. Initially, you gotta understand the recoil pattern of the guns. This weird graphic here explains the recoil direction. It can go towards up and left or all the way up. Once you know it, when you aim, you gotta compensate the recoil, move your aim to the opposite direction, to down and right or just down. It's the best way to keep your shoots stable. However, it works if your enemy is close by you. If he is far away though, you gotta use bursts. Shoot and release the button. Shoot and release. This is the best way to control the recoil, especially for high fire rate guns. When you release the shoot button, your aim will center back again, allowing easier headshots. What else is very important here is always move with your aim downside. If you feel like an action is about to happen, you gotta be prepared. One second make the whole difference between kill and die in this game. And Keep your central aim on the limits of the corners that reveal unknown areas. You will have a better response to shoot if you see an enemy. Sometimes you know an enemy is coming towards you. It means you don't need to wait to see him to start a firefight. You can shoot a couple times even before see him and hit. But when the enemy gets in your range, he will be dead before he has noticed. By the way, keep your aim up. Enemies have basically the same size. You can predict where enemy's head will be to shoot him. The crosshair placement is rule number one to get headshots. Try always to go for headshots. This is the best way to eliminate the threats. After a while, when you get confident, you can try to do this quick move scope, especially when you know where the enemies are. Move your body without seeing anything and shoot. Take over, come back, shoot again. Keep doing this and maybe you can get a headshot. You basically gotta point the aim and shoot as soon as you get out of the cover. And the good point is, you will not expose yourself and you can kill the enemy giving him no chance at all to react. Ok guys, today's video was an idea of my subscriber Alex. If you have any suggestion, let me know down below at the comment section. Next topic can be your idea. That's it guys, I hope this video has helped you somehow and if it did, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. There are much more coming up. Catch you later and bye amigos.